what's going on guys welcome back to the channel we finally finally had some amazing weather here in Pennsylvania and I was finally able to get out to some yard sales you're probably saying so where's that footage at Mike well there is none and here's why we actually put the GoPro on our book bag and we drove out to these community sales we went to a community sale and one other separate yard sale this weekend me and my daughter drove out there we had some other stuff to do and I said, let's go to these sales and let's see what happens. Let's get some footage for these videos. Well, when we got to the yard sales, I didn't take out the book bag. I left the camera in the car. Probably thinking, why would you do that? Well, even after two years of having this channel, there are some times that I personally get a bad vibe from people filming at their house and in their yard and stuff like that. Today was one of those. Today, I just could not, I did not feel comfortable filming at these yard sales. Some of the people just gave off a bad vibe in general and I just said, you know what? I'm gonna leave the camera in the car and I'm just gonna go shopping and find stuff to sell on eBay. My daughter then mentioned, Dad, what are you gonna do about the footage? Well, we're gonna go old school here because we've done this on the channel before. We're gonna do a haul video and show you what we found. The first yard set we went to, found one thing for 50 cents a piece of Tupperware. I'm not going to show you that. I'm not going to bother showing you the Tupperware. The second yard sale, though, we found some great stuff. At that point, we decided to head back to the community sale because guess what? Only one of the houses started early. So we got back to the community sale when it started at 9 o'clock, and we crushed it. We spent a grand total of $80 in a matter of two hours. Actually, $60 because I came home with an extra 20 bucks. We found some amazing items to sell on eBay and even some items that will possibly sell at our yard sale that is coming up. But before I show you these items, guys, make sure you hit that subscribe button if you'd like to. If you don't want to, no big deal. Don't worry about it. If you want to hit the share button, share it. Like it. It's not totally up to you. And feel free to leave a comment if you'd like. Also, guys, we have some exciting news coming up. I'm debating how to tell you guys about it. I might let the kids tell you. I'm not 100% sure yet. So just stay tuned for some important and exciting news for the channel. And maybe something else. So... Let's get in these items and show you what we found. So one of the last things we found was some Carhartt work pants and a Carhartt shirt. Uh, we picked these up for three bucks each. They are actually in the washer now, getting washed and cleaned. So I can't show you those, but we paid $3 each for those. I don't think we're gonna have a problem selling those and making a profit. We also picked up these truly hard seltzer Hawaiian shirts, flower shirts. Picked up two of these for three bucks each. Uh, these were just kind of thrown in the deal with the Carhartt stuff, so. Don't have really much involved in, in that, involved. We don't have much invested in these, so a couple bucks. I don't have, I don't I think these will sell. It might take a little bit, but we'll get these listed up. Super easy to list, so happy with that. We also found this for two bucks at a yard sale. Sorry guys, I'm getting over a cold, so if my voice sounds really raspy, that's why. Picked up Snow White and the Seven dwarf fi Dwarfs figures. The date on these, if I remember right, when I saw it, it was like 1990. 1993 so super cool find for two bucks on these uh, I'm not sure how much these will go for we actually didn't even look them up my daughter also picked up a book at the yard sale for 50 cents even though it said two bucks but ah what are you gonna do picked up this nice Dunkin Donuts cup here for 50 cents I think it was so it looks it looks pretty brand new I'm not even sure it was used yeah I'm not hundred percent sure it was used so for 50 cents I wasn't leaving this behind and honestly my wife might use this if it doesn't sell few things upstairs that I'm going to show you in our garage, but one of the better finds of the day was this driver head. You're probably thinking, where's the shaft? Well, driver heads sell, and this one actually does really well. I didn't price it while I was there, but they actually had $15 on it. I think, yep, yeah, 15 bucks on this thing. Uh, it's a Nike VRS Covert Tour driver head. Very clean. It doesn't even look like it's been hit that much. Maybe a few times. I made an offer of 10 bucks. I didn't look it up, so I had no idea what the comps were. One just recently sold for $124.99. If I remember, I'll pop one up here. If not, I apologize. I told you what the price was, so... We'll leave it at that. But yeah, this is a really good find. I'm going to try to get this listed as soon as I can just because it is golf season and stuff like this sells quick. So keep your eyes open for golf stuff like this because even without the shaft, these things still sell. Okay, so the next thing we got, we ended up picking up this dog bone toy box. It is for this one right here. I'm going to say hi, Anna. Say hi. Say hi. You won't be shy. Hopefully people will see more of you soon. But yeah, we picked this up, I think, for three bucks. So it was really cool. We could actually put all of our toys in there. 
and it'll keep everything organized. Then we picked up these two things right here, this Harry Potter book set. This is from Target. It has the one, year one, year two, year three in it. She ended up giving this up to us for 10 bucks. This thing sells for about 50 plus, so super happy to get this. It is really, really heavy, but yeah, I don't see the problem selling this, but my wife mentioned about possibly keeping this, so we'll see what happens there. But then we also picked up this Instamax, or Instax Mini 20 Fujifilm little uh, pictures. Uh, we picked this up for a quarter, so this thing sells for about 15 bucks at 20, so really good, should be a quick flip. And then last but not least, yep, there's the book bag I was using. The camera, I think, is actually still on it, but I didn't film right there. Yep, I didn't film, so like I mentioned earlier. But we picked up these Steeler cornhole boards. They actually came with all the bean bags and the cornhole boards. Basically brand new. I bet they were only used one time. We paid $15 for it. Now, I'm still not 100% sure if I'm going to keep it or sell it. We were having a yard sale, like I mentioned, so this might get sold on Facebook Marketplace. You're probably like, is that a bread machine? This is a bread machine. This is the Bread Man Ultimate. It says seven bucks. They gave it to us for five. Here's why I bought it. The bread pan with the paddle. This bread pan sells alone for 40 bucks. 35, 40 bucks alone. I could probably get about 75 to 80 for the whole machine itself. It is in really, really good shape, but I may part it out just for that. So we will see what happens and I'll keep you guys posted. So that was everything we found at these yard sales, a community sale and another separate sale. Uh, I think we did really well. I think we spent, I think I mentioned 60 bucks. So really, really good. Uh, I think we're gonna have a really good profit on this stuff that we so bought. I did leave behind a ton of stuff and that is because I am personally just tired of picking up stuff that's going to sit here forever. If it's something I can flip easier or if I know I can make a good profit on it and I might sit on it for a little bit, I'll pick it up. But I'm not going to pick up these items that are going to sell for 3 bucks 4 months down the road. I'm just not going to. I'm tired of storing stuff and I just want to buy stuff and move it just quickly to make the profit. I don't have money just tied up in this stuff. So, that being said, hit that subscribe button, like, and share it. And guys, we'll see you next time. Bye.